All right, so this is a review of the Manfrotto Action Tripod, I think is what it's called. It's actually one of my favorite tripods I've ever bought. Actually, it's the first expensive tripod I've ever bought. And I'll tell you right now, it is definitely worth the money. Um, I'm pretty sure if you've ever bought expensive tripods, you already know it's worth the money. I always buy cheap stuff like this one over here. Uh, like this piece of crap. But um, it does the job, you know? And one thing I do realize that I like the great about this particular tripod is this little thing back here, this little wheel. When you're recording, let me just turn on my... This is a Canon T4i with a 1.8 lens. Uh, let's go turn this. Actually, one thing I do like about it too, which is nice, is that you can go into a vertical position fairly easily. All you have to do is actually a little switch over here. I mean, so you can just unlock, lock, see it just twists around pretty easily. And then you can just lock in place. It locks pretty good. And if you want to go vertical, all you have to do is you just flip this over. And then you unlock it again by twisting it down, and then you can go on to the side. First you have to twist it, you turn this back, and then, actually, as you can tell, I don't use vertical very often. And there you go. There you go, see? It doesn't require, it's not rocket science. And you can lock this in place, and there you go. Now you're set for vertical, then you just Twist this here to lock it in place, and boom. So then if you want to unlock it so that you can move this around better, you can lock it again. And now you're all set to shoot vertical, take shoot vertically, taking some pictures here if you want. Uh, I want to do. I want to show you that this, is go, this does go a bit higher. Uh, I'll put specs in the description, and there'll be a link to the best price on Amazon in case you're interested in that. Uh, let's go ahead and get this to come down. One thing I will say is that this is not designed for like a heavy DSLR, so I'm pretty sure that if you had a like a uh, Canon Mark III, uh, you're definitely not going to want to use this tripod. Uh, this is really meant for like a Canon T4i. I think this is actually I'm actually at the weight capacity limit because this lens is so heavy. Maybe about five eight. So this tripod is goes up to about five eight, five foot eight inches tall, uh, or not five eight, five eight, probably five four maybe. So the, the other cool thing that makes this so awesome is really this right here. This little thing right here, I love this thing because you can put this on here and you can lock it in place. Here, let me show you that real quick. That is like the cool, that's the, that's my, that's the part I love the most. That's the part of making this selling here because uh, I mean, it's up to you you're gonna buy this, but I mean, take a look at this. All you do is you flip this open. There you go. And you can put this back on, boom, just like that. I can use this interchangeably. Basically forces me to use Manfrotto tripods now and I, once you get good quality tripod it's kind of hard and this is not even that expensive of a tripod I think I bought it for 60 or 70 bucks um, uh, but let me go ahead and break it down it's pretty lightweight I'm gonna go ahead and unlock this real quick that way you can kind of see so there we go open these close it up open these Close it up, open these, close it up, and there you go. It gives you an idea of how, how much it breaks down. If you want to make it break, get a little smaller profile, you can. Here, let me just actually yeah, take this out. Okay, there you go, and then boom, perfect. So you can see how this breaks down. Uh, there'll be more specs of the exact weight and everything you see here. Uh, but if you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment. This is the Manfrotto Action Tripod. Uh, oh, one more thing. It does come with a little carrying case. I don't ever take this out, but if you wanted to, it does come with this in case you want to know what the accessories it comes with. And that's pretty much it. Oh, and it comes, it comes with basically the tripod, this bottom piece here, and then this. All right, thanks for watching. This is Ryan Saplin signing out. I'll see you guys later.